anaitwa Adha Mandela Nyongesa. Adha alizaliwa mwaka wa 1990. Kidogo kidogo kuanzia 2019. Alianza kwanza kupotea potea. Nikimwambia kuja nyumbani, ah, hakuji sana. Anasema mama niko very busy. Niko ah, nikasema ni sawa. Sasa kuanzia tu hapo alinyamaza na ni hivyo kuanzia hapo sijai msikia. Sasa ikawa ame cut off na mimi ameni block. Atasa mimi ndio nikaona wacha ni appeal mahali penye adha yako. Acho mama yako na mtaka. <laughs> ni uchungu. Kukaa miaka wine pia kuona mtoto wako sio raisi. Sio raisi. I'm so sorry. Paka mtu nakuwa emotional. It's not easy. Na pili mali penye yako. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and subscribe for more news updates. So kwa hii channel tunakupa kuria udaku yote from all the social media tunakuganishia, tunakupa kuria. So huyu kijana anaitwa Xandera. Xandera nimeingia kwa internet, uh, you know ni kwa high school na campus na nikamjua uh, vilivyo. So ni mtu ambaye ni talented sana, amesaidia brats mingi uh, kama citizen, uh, you know, uh, Kiswana Hadred Radio Africa. So kwa jina lake kamili anaitwa Adha Madera Nyongesa. So amewak kuligana na umaarufu wake amewak na brass kubwa watu kama kina Jeff Koinange other presenters like Adru Kibe Kamene Goro and na ame meet uh, people uh, from different sco scopes uh, in fact i meet huyu Bobby Wine abaye ni activists from Uganda so huyu ni mamake uh, you know Aksiandera ambaye amekuja online kwa tetezi kwa mtoto wake from 2019 till now four years down the line aliwa cut off so uh, Aksiandera uh, kuna sababu zake huko mwisho wa video utamsikia akisema na huyu ni bibi yake Fatima Baji ambaye alikuwa ni uh, Uh, you know uh, video vixen alikuwa featured kwa gome ya Nyashinski na uh, Juma uri wa Tanzania so uh, you know before uh, you know uh, kukua kwa fame uh, Xendera aliwahi kuwa featured in a song he si goma yake lakini hapa tu amekuwa featured kama video vice ambaye nimeangalia vizuri sana hii video nimeipata Twitter na nika verify si goma yake lakini hii ni gospel song alikuwa featured in So Xendera for the better part uh, before coronavirus uh, 2019 mamake alianza kuwa na uoga na katika interview alikuwa anasema kwa huzuni kuwa kuna time aliona Xendera amejata tu na mienendo yake ilikuwa awkward kidogo na hapo akamshusha kidogo akamcriticize kidogo obvious ile ya mother's rough but Xendera alisim hiyo story alijam nayo so mamake unhappen kwa kwa kibidi inajita hura baro ambaye ni kipindi moja ya red uh, tv moja hapa nchini so when uh, covid hit after mamake kumcriticize you know uh, kila mtu alitafuta kitu ya kudu online na Xendera uh, kanjipata time ya corona anafanya kipindi kinaitwa club covid abacho uh, ni wasichana walikuwa wana dance na bra na panty peke alafu pale kulikuwa na mchango kama kwa hii screenshot kuna shaka pebil pale chini uh, mnatuma pesa alafu kama mmetuma 300k anawapa ana wasichana prizes za 10000 10500 alafu nyingine anabaki nayo wanasamanga ni ya kulipa internet haha <laughs> so uh, hii show uh, ilitoa tetezi mingi sana of course even the government was not about this uh, extended in fact was arrested and charged in a court of law na mamake pia hakufurahia hii show pia ilimpa umaarufu msichana um, kwa jina Shakira baye ni celebrity mmoja hapa Kenya aliyeja controversies so from hiyo time Xendera kurudi kwa internet uh, hakurudi uh, vizuri na kiurahisi so akaanza kufanya Instagram marketing uh, kama venye Eddie Gobali alikuwa anasema anafanya but of course ili kuleta traffic walikuwa wanafanya celebrity exposes na politician wanawa expose so kuna hii moja alifanya ya governor wa Spokot ambaye uh, kulikuwa na tetezi kuwa ametumia msichana news msichana aka expose so 
mamake extendera amekuwa bitter na amekam akilia ona na kisema yeye tu anataka kupatana na mtoto wake waongee na ye. but uh, mtoto wake amewa cut off uh, brother zake na mamake na ni kisa abacho mamake at one point alijaribu kumfikia extendera uh, through kutuma uh, Fatma Baji ambaye ni yake extend akamwambia kuna issue nyumbani na ni emergency na kwamba extendera agefa afike lakini that i thought born of fruits extend dera was nowhere to be seen so a uh, extian katika podcast moja amefanya hivi majuzi ameogelea kuhusu toxicity you know lack of uh, kukuwa na boundaries na criticism of course alikuwa anarifa mamake na watu pale online wanauliza je hiyo ni sababu poa ya kukat off mzazi you know a bringing of parents si same kia bahari kwamba kuna wazazi huwa wapedi dread dogs wengine wapedi tatu but haimaanishi si mzazi wako na huwezi da ukimchukia ama kumnyima kumtembelea miaka nne. so na pia sifikirii kuwa extendera amekuwa akiweza kusaidia mamake baye kuona mama at hit time ana act ni you know hii ni time ya mama kupumzika but pengine ni kwa sababu hapati usaidizi kwa kuwa kijana wake miaka nne hajakuwa kimwongelea so mimi uh, kulingana na venye nime compare uh, hii video sijaona sababu mzuri ya extend kukata of mamake but you guys what do you think do you think venye indifferences za kurelewa zinafaa ushoyo apparent hit comment on your thoughts